I'm really proud and really happy to have the chance of presenting the interim analysis of the Eastbourne trial here during Europe PCR 2019. The big question about this study is that uh, how is this new device uh, eluting serolimus faring in coronary arteries? ISPUN trial is enrolling patients for any type of uh, coronary disease. So uh, they are instant restenosis, they are small vessel disease, side branch, whatever. Whenever you use this device for coronary use, you have to put your patient into this registry. And what is important is that you have to put all of your patients consecutively in because we don't want to create any bias in the selection of the patients. The key findings are that this device is very safe, so we didn't have any MIs or any cardiac death related to the device to the follow-up that we have so far. Because out of the 1,000 patients that we have enrolled so far, we have a limited follow-up up to 12 months, but in these 207 patients, there were no uh, safety signals. And this is the most important thing. Another important thing that we have shown with this one is the feasibility of the, of the use of this device with a very high percent of uh, angiographic success and procedural success. These are the two key elements that we have shown with this one. So far we have limited data, but what we have show a very good efficacy of this device. So on top of what I have said regarding the safety of this device, it is also very effective with a very low TLR rate. In this 207 patients cohort, we have a 2.4% of TLR, which is very good. We need to assess, I have to tell this, uh, all of these events once we will have finished the follow-up and uh, uh, once we have finished the enrollment, obviously, of the patients, but uh, the preliminary data are very encouraging. The next steps will be uh, to finish the enrollment of the patients, because so far we have enrolled 1,200 patients, but we, wa we want to reach as soon as possible the 2,000. So 2,000 patients will be the largest DCB registry ever. We want to finish it and to go for the primary endpoint, which is one-year TLR, and to see if the this device is really promising as it seems.